हे गाइस आई एम मिशान एंड वेलकम टू साइबर नाटिको सो इन दिस वीडियो लेट्स सी अ क्वेश्चन दैट सेज राइट अ फंक्शन व्हिच टेक्स एन एरे ऑफ मल्टीपल फंक्शंस एंड एग्जीक्यूट्स देम वन बाय वन इन लेफ्ट टू राइट मैनर एंड इट हैज बीन आस्क्ड बाय जोमैटो इन देयर इंटरव्यू सेशन और क्वेश्चंस सो लेट्स ट्राई टू टैकल दिस क्वेश्चन आवर अप्रोच शुड बी सिंपल we will create an array first so let's create an array of uh, this const fn array and it will be a array yes so step 1 that was and inside we will have some functions so it says it takes an array oh, sorry array of multiple functions so let's create multiple functions so let function keyword we need fn that's how we write a function let's return return a plus b let's write the params here fine we have a function to add two numbers let's repeat it three times this will be subtract so minus multiplication and this one should be division so we have an array of four functions so this part is done now let's execute it so let's create a function a main function that it says in the question so write a main function so const main fn we can make this an arrow function inside this we can call this array using map method simply but first we have to call this function in this effect as well if you want to run it on the page mounts on the page mount sorry not yes not here here sorry 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 here we have to write so we will simply map this fn array so we can say map to get all the functions inside directly it takes an parameter called fn and we can simply return this fn function now let's store the data inside one variable because it's returning it so console dot okay let's do this let's say let data or let's say let result so whatever we get from all this function executions we will get inside this result the data we will get inside this result so we'll get addition subtraction multiplication division all these and then we can simply console it to check in the console so result let's open the console and check what we are getting right now it will be an error we are getting this array yes it's an error because all the four items are giving an an because we are not passing this values which is a and b so let's pass 2 and 3 so refresh now we are getting this so 2 and 3 we are passing so this will be 5 minus 1 because 2 minus 3 equals to minus 1 this should be 6 because multiplication and this should be This zero point six 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 five. We can make this as four or six and three. Then we will get this nine because we are adding them. Uh, three we are subtracting them. Eighteen multiplication and two as division. So that was how we do it in an array. But we have one more option here to do this. Not in an array, but in an array object. So let me comment this and wrap this in an object. like this we will make an add value here add key now this add will add this add will run when the function is running i mean this add will run when we call the add so why don't we make this as something else called or make this function as add and this should be a simple key name which will be function now we have the add function similarly let's repeat it multiple times okay not this let's repeat this. let's make it minus multiplication and division yeah, division now this should be divide this should be what can we call it multiply or multiply multiply yes this should be sub subtract now we have now four different functions add subtract 
multiply and divide save we can remove this but let's leave it now we will call fn.fn because we have a key name here in this object because right now it will give an error if we refresh the page cannot write properties sorry fn is not a function so we will do fn.fn and that will work now the same way refresh and we are getting all the four items after subtract after addition or sum subtraction division and multiplication so in both cases we can do it so i think that's all the question has been solved we have a function that takes array of multiple functions and executes them one by one left to right so left to right means from top to bottom if we are saying this formatted code so add is that left then second left third left and fourth left so that was how we do it and it's done